Hello everyone, my name is Kumar Aditya and in this video I will show you how you can plot the characteristics of a MOSFET using LTS files. So for this uh, video I am using this particular MOSFET from NXP. It is rated for 40 volt and current rating is 120 amps at VGS of 10 volt and mounting base temperature of uh, 25 degree Celsius. So this is the basic uh, rating of this MOSFET. And essentially, I'm trying to I'm trying to capture this uh, plot in LTS files. So I'm trying to plot uh, drain current versus uh, drain to source voltage for different value of K2 source voltage. And for this purpose, uh, I have written this command here. I'm performing a DC sweep on uh, drain to source voltage from 0 volt to 4 volt in the increment of 1 millivolt. And I am doing this for five different value of VGS, you know, this VGS, 4 volt, 4.5 volt, 5 volt, 6 volt, and 10 volt to match the uh, data sheet uh, plot. Now, if I run the simulation, I get this curve. So on the X axis, on the X axis, I have VDS. And on the Y axis, I have the drain current. And I have five curve for five different value of VGS. So this is for VGS is equal to 10 volt. This is for VGS is equal to 6 volt. This is for 5 volt. This is for 4.5 volt and this is for 4 volt. So I guess you get an idea how you can uh, plot the characteristics of the data sheet. One thing is that uh, this data sheet uh, shows the maximum drain current to be 200 amp so you can match that you just uh, need to you just need to adjust the uh, setting here uh, on the y-axis so you make it uh, maximum 200 amp and you can start from you know 0 amp and there you go you now have a correlation with uh, the data sheet curve uh, don't worry about this uh, axis here, it's showing 0 amp because there is some kind of glitch in the LT spice, but this is essentially 200 amp. And uh, another thing you may notice is that the, um, the plot in the LT spice, the current remains flat uh, after a certain uh, drain source voltage, no matter how much VDS is increasing. However, in uh, data sheet this is not entirely flat it's uh, in fact uh, increasing with uh, uh, very i know a very gradual slope um, but it's not flat like the uh, plot in the lt file and this is due to the reason that the model provided by the nxp is not very thorough it's a very basic model so it does not capture the true behavior of the uh, physical MOSFET. But nonetheless, if you have a uh, model which is uh, uh, very detailed, you can have a uh, very, uh, you know, uh, point by point match with the uh, data seed plot. Uh, let me show you the second plot also. So this is the same plot. Uh, but uh, instead of plotting the drain current with respect to VDS, this is plotting the drain current with respect to VGS and drain to source voltage is fixed at 12 volt. So to capture this, what you can do is uh, uh, perform the sweep only on gate to source voltage. So I am disabling this command and enabling this DC sweep. So now I am sweeping the gate to source voltage and my drain to source voltage is fixed at 12 volt. So if I run the simulation, you see I get this curve, this particular curve, and this is very similar to the curve pattern in the data sheet. Obviously the data sheet uh, has three different curves for three different temperature, but this model is very basic and it does not uh, capture the thermal behavior of the uh, MOSFET. Therefore, even though I am changing the, I am trying to plot the curve for three different temperature, 25, 85, 125 degrees Celsius, there is no effect on the um, plot. It's just plotting for one default temperature of 
let's I, I guess it's 25 degrees Celsius. So if you have a MOSFET model which has a thermal behavior coded in, you will get a, a series of curve for each temperature variation like shown in the data set. I hope you get the idea and this uh, may be useful to you in some way. Bye-bye.